Hey, it's Kobe with KobeRot.com, and in this quick video, I'm going to show you how to use the Sales Funnel Ninja software. So, after we open and run the software, this is the welcome screen that we're greeted with, so I'm just going to go ahead and click close. Now, the first thing that you need to do, you can see here it says, what is your headline? So, I'm just going to put in a headline here. Let's do how to add 100 to 300 subscribers to your list even with no list at all or even with no list there we go and then click next next thing it's going to ask you for the call to action I'm going to leave it as a default which is enter best email below this will show above the opt-in box now it's going to ask me to paste in my opt-in form so I'm going to do that I've got it right here so I'm just going to copy and paste that in and click next and the URL for the redirect that's what they'll be sent after they opt in I'm going to click next and enter the name or pin name using your emails Kobe Wright and what is the company name or website name? I'm um, going to leave them out the default, which is koberoute.com. If you have an LLC or something like that, you can also put that in here as well. Click Next. What year is it? I'm going to leave it the default, which is 2013, because that's the current year. Enter your help desk or support. And you could also put in, uh, now these are all optional. The next couple tags are optional. You could put in an email here by, you know, just including the mail to tag, which is mail to hyphen, and then the email address. I'm going to leave it at the help desk and click Next. Earnings disclaimer. Put that in here. Click next. Next one is privacy policy. Put the link in here. Click next. And then the last one we're going to get is terms of use. So if you have a terms of use page, put that in here. And this is the last step, so I'm going to cl create click create funnel. And then I'm going to choose the folder where I want to save it. Demo. Now the software is going to put it there and while it does that it's also going to pop up this right here tell me it was success and that all I need to do is upload the file the index and the redirect files to my server so I'm going to go ahead and exit this and if you want to save the information that you've put in the software you can by clicking yes I'm not going to so let's open up our output folder and see what it did so here's our demo folder and uh, you can see it gives us four files in here there's a success file that is the one we just read and this is the redirect and then the the opt-in, the index is the uh, the squeeze page and then the images folder. So let's start by looking at the squeeze page that it, it creates for us. So you can see this is a really slick looking squeeze page that creates here a really nice, clean, professional, looks very good. And if they click on the on the video here to try to play it, then they get the, whoa, hold your horses, enter email address in the box to the right for instant access. So this is a trigger script and you can see down here, it's got the footer information that we input. These are all links that will open in separate window and again if you uh, skip these and you can open up composer and just edit those out and so after we opt in then it's going to take us to the redirect page which is this one and you can see it says you've got mail check for an email from Kobe Rot. you will be shown the video in it's counting down from 10 seconds and it says do not close this page and once it counts down to 10 seconds it's going to redirect me to the page that has the video which is this one autosfindermagic.net forward slash sneak peek and so there you go it's that cool it's that easy it's that simple that's how you use the sales funnel ninja and if you have any questions just let me know this is kobe with kobe signing off